Hello, and welcome to this presentation on paragraph writing. Now, although there are several types of academic text, the basic unit of an academic text is a paragraph. Academic texts address certain wider problems, questions or issues, and the smaller parts of these issues are brought into focus in the paragraphs of the text. And each paragraph must be focused on one and only one idea regarding the overall topic and the position you have taken on it, which you have signalled in the thesis statement. This focus comes from what is called cohesion and unity. So, a paragraph deals with one main or controlling point. If you want to focus on another point, you must start a new paragraph. Now, let's move on to see just how paragraphs are actually structured. Paragraphs are structured so as to have two parts, a topic sentence and support sentences. The topic sentence signals what you are going to talk about in the paragraph, in other words, the controlling idea, and it's followed by several support sentences containing information, examples and reasoning related to that main or controlling idea. Let's go on to have a look at an example of this. Okay, well, let's move on to an example of the thesis statement taken from an essay about vegetarianism. And this is how the thesis statement might go. People should follow vegetarian diets because they are best for their health, the environment and the well-being of animals. And it's worth noting here that this thesis statement is usually the last sentence of the introduction paragraph to the essay, with the body paragraphs to follow. Now, if we look closely at this, we'll see that the writer has taken a position on the issue of vegetarian diets, and offered three points to support this position or claim which will later be reflected in the body paragraphs of the academic text. In this case, an essay will follow. So, let's move on to an example of a topic sentence based on this thesis statement. OK, so here's an example of a topic sentence based on the thesis statement we've just seen. The first reason why people should follow vegetarian diets is that they are best for their health. Now, if you look closely, you'll notice several things about this topic sentence. Firstly, it contains an indication or a signal about which supporting point from the thesis statement the paragraph will focus on. The first one. Secondly, there is a reminder or a restatement of the position you've taken on the issue. You are for vegetarian diets. And lastly, the supporting point from the thesis statement is mentioned, in this case, health. So, the first reason why people should follow vegetarian diets is that they are best for their health is our first topic sentence, which will be found in the first body paragraph of your essay on the topic. Let's now move on to the rest of the paragraph and what it will contain. Okay, so the rest of the paragraph will contain sentences supporting this particular point about health. This support can be achieved by using a variety of means, including the following support types. Facts, statistics, theory, logic, paraphrase, direct quotation, explanation. The support you use must be credible and acceptable to your audience. Generally speaking, it will come from books and journals authored by respected academics. Since it's best to use the most up-to-date information, journals tend to be the best sources of support. But just a word of caution. Internet sources may appear up-to-date, but as there is generally not good quality control measures in place on the web, it's best to avoid them as sources of support information. OK, well, let's move on to having a look at some sample paragraphs with a bit of commentary. 
OK, so to finish off, let's look at a couple of sample paragraphs and commentary on them provided by the Learning Skills Unit of RMIT Vietnam, from which some of this material has been modified. Pause the video here and take your time to look at a well-written paragraph, a poorly written paragraph, and the commentaries on both. Okay, well, thank you for listening and good luck with your paragraph writing.